What did they say? How'd you know I even What did they say I heard? I'm getting you the money. Wait, they have it? Yeah. They have it? Yeah, I told you they would. Guys, my car is finally going to run again. Wait, which which store has it? Huh? Which store has it? AutoZone. AutoZone? I needed a fuel pump a month ago. I went to see the Fast and Furious movie and my car randomly broke down on my way home because I got something blocking my fuel pump. I guess that's what my grandpa said at least. And I'm finally going to get a new one and my car is finally going to run again. Yes, it is such a nice day out. How long does it take to install? Don't take long. Doesn't take long? Okay, let's get over to the auto parts store. My, uh, my dad called about the 289 hypo fuel pump. Yes. So I'm now driving home and this box is the fix to all of my problems. I'm so excited to get this in. I've been wanting to drive my car for so damn long. There was something really weird that I noticed when I walked into the auto parts store. I'm not sexist or anything, but literally all the workers in this auto parts store were all women. Every single one of them. There was not a dude in the store. It was it was kind of weird. But yeah, let's get home. Let's get this part installed. Teach me how to install this. What? Put it in. Do you just like throw it out the car and then it goes in? No. Just, just uh. Rolling out. That, hey. di that didn't work. Don't do that. <laughs> You're okay, help me get this in. So this is the new one. My dad took out the old one while I was going to the auto parts store. This is the old one. This thing is straight out of 1967. That thing has never been changed. Hmm. All right, let's get the new one in. So we just got done putting the piece down in there. Uh, Dad, move your hand. Move so I can, so I can see. Dang. But it's down there. It was, it was, uh, it was quite annoying to get in there. That freaking bolt had like this much clearance to get through, so we just had to like keep switching the the socket around and just inching it on there, inching it on there. But it was annoying. We're gonna get the fuel lines on now, and I will update you guys after. So yeah, that is the vlog for today, guys. I know it was kind of short, but I was just glad to get the car running. I wasn't even planning vlogging today. But the car got running again, so that means that I can go to a lot of car shows. So hit that subscribe button to stay tuned in for more. And if you enjoyed the video, please leave a like and subscribe. That would help me out a lot. And yeah, guys, I will catch you in the next video, which will probably be Monday, because Sunday I'm going to Jake's to finish the new motor, actually. So yeah, stay tuned for that. That will be a good one. Peace out, guys.